What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? See what I mean, man? Terrible. Hello, survivors, and welcome to We Who Survive. My name is James, and this is episode 18 of our Stay Frosty New Game Plus with Darlena Russ. So we are going to get cracking here, I think. What we're going to do... Please, no addiction. All right, no addiction. I think what we are going to do is... Uh, we're going to keep exploring up here, because we're never really up here. Now, I, it's only like 7.30 p.m., unfortunately, and I wanted to know what happens if we sleep until there's some light, but even if we sleep till 5.30 a.m. when it's pitch black still, we get all the way to like mildly dehydrated or something, so it doesn't work out. It takes all our water. It's not a very good idea. So we're not gonna sleep. We're probably gonna walk around in the dark, which is gonna be absolutely miserable, but we're gonna do what we have to do have made a bunch of food so we're definitely good on food and i don't think i got my buff from this thing my weight buff because i think i'm always at 105 right 110 now but i thought i was pretty sure that i'm supposed to get some sort of plus five buff which was the whole point of why i built and used this I don't know, I really thought it gave you like a temporary perk or something, but I'm not seeing anything, so I guess that is not happening. Maybe it gave me one strength and that's what does it. I'm not sure, dude. Okay, but I, I don't know if we're getting our bonus or not. Either way, we're very heavy and that's a problem for continued exploring, but hopefully we don't run into anything too good to take part of the problem is we found a bunch of ammo uh some of it heavier like the plasma cartridges but that's not exactly everything so now i do have two dirty waters which are going to take up two pounds oh, okay i only got one not bad and we have to eat two i think right do we have to eat uh it doesn't say we have to eat yet but we probably should anything these are like half meals i still have oh no i'm out of cram holy crap that's not good okay well i've just got to remind myself we do have plenty of food it's just maybe not in the form i would like it but we'll drop off this crab meat here as well Alright, and then yeah, we also have that squirrel on a stick I forgot about. So we're going to eat these two cooked Salisbury steaks. That will also give us a couple sanity, help prevent us from getting hungry here shortly. And I think that's the best I got, folks. I believe we are going to head out. So I think the uh, attempted route, we're going to try to get somewhere to outpost... Zimonja, which is up here roughly. I think that's the plan. We'll see how it works out. Ten Pines is pretty much a straight shot from Sanctuary on the map, and it's somewhere centered in here. So maybe we'll go to Ten Pines along the way. I don't know if it's going to be a super eventful episode. I hope not. But uh, we'll see what happens. We'll explore up here a bit, because I have not really. All right, so I got my settlement save. We're free to go from here. Dobby is a free elf, free to die, basically. All right, Red Rocket has ghouls. It is sort of tempting to try and snipe them, maybe. Not sure how wise that is, though. Why did I just do that? I did not mean to, wrong button. Those would be an intricate piece of the puzzle, though, where we to clear the red rocket. Those mines. Almost certain of that. I don't know how close I can get before they even notice. Did you really just notice me, dog? Just like that. That's all it took. Alright, I guess we're in it now. And look 
who's the one who survived? You mother trucker. Oh, there's three more. You guys are gonna make me use all my IEDs or what? This is getting ridiculous. I think we might have got them though. Like, if I can take these out. Preferably without wasting all my ammo, but we'll see. Okay, maybe I use the emergency flare here. Incendiary grenade, frag grenade, emergency flare. Let's go for this. Yo, this thing is crazy. No, my hotkeys stopped working, dude. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me with that. Alright, so now I have to do this every time I want to switch weapons. It's going to be a lot. Decent. Dang, that was 51 experience too, so that was a strong ghoul. Alright, that worked out about as well as it could. I'm still on my settlement, so actually what I should do, I'm going to save and reload, and hopefully that fixes my hotkeys. Yay. Dude, I can't believe we just cleared the red rocket. That's almost perfect. I don't know if we should do Outpost Zimonja and all that, because I really need a shorter episode this week. This is my birthday weekend, and so tomorrow I'm actually still going to my mom's for dinner, so I'm going to lose most of my main editing day on Sunday. But, uh, yeah, maybe we'll still do some more looking around. That's crazy, though. That already makes for something, that's for sure. Holy crap, boys. I can't believe we done did it. Can't believe we done did it. Basically on accident. Well, not on accident, but on a whim. Basically on a whim. Down to one IED, sadly. Holy crap. Oh, is this where he lost a limb? Yeah, he lost a limb back here. I wanted to, if I could, use this car. I think it sort of got used, but I think for the most part they were already past it. <laughs> okay, and I thought there was a dog or something up here too, though. It wasn't just the ghouls. There was an enemy dog or something too, I would swear. Dang, boys, we really got Red Rocket. Ooh, that makes the north a little more fun now. You got the whole little, uh, whole little northwest corner. Dang, so, oh yeah, we can take this. Huh? Yo, I would swear I just heard somebody. I guess it's just paranoia. We're not insane, right? No, we're not insane, so I shouldn't be hearing stuff. Alright, okay, cool. Let's have a look around here real quick then. Ooh, we got a bottle. Bottles are good. We need water. Definitely need water. Ooh, actual ammo too. Cigarette cartons are money, but they're also a pound each. They're pretty heavy, so... XL, that's nice. Okay, we got wood and we got some more cash. Is there anything extra on the terminal here? Place the brakes, place the alternator. No, so I think everything on here is the same. Although, what is this? Take care of these barrels before you leave. Just hide them with the others. We'll figure out if nature's going to favor us with a cave. Oh, okay, so that's about the rat cave, which I think i'm almost certain we already cleared that out in this run again everything sort of runs together for me so i can't say 100 percent sure but i'm pretty sure we already cleared that cave oh and i think i actually left the sick 10 millimeter pistol in there too so dang we're gonna have some good plasma cartridges which is good because that means we can actually use our plasma weapons boys 
Alright, the music's nice, but probably copywritten, so... Mm, nothing too crazy there. Maybe this stuff I'll just throw right into the workbench here. And hang on to the nuclear material, because we might be able to use that for some weapon upgrades, like certain sites and stuff, so... Probably want to keep that close and on us, so we're not going to be hanging out up here that much. Not until we start actually building settlements, like, practically. Two bottles. So does that give me three bottles? Oh, wait, no, I got dirty water and two bottles. So I could make another water. Maybe I'll go do that real quick, and then we head out. All right, well, I'm glad I decided to stop and do that, because I had to drink a water on the way. Now, unfortunately, it's just getting darker and darker and darker, so... That makes everything extra precarious, of course, but at least now, I think I can mostly stick to the road. It might be worth... there might be some value to going through the woods, because I know there's some stuff in there, but... I mean... We could almost straight shot it from here, according to the map. Okay. Just a deer. A deer. I'm afraid of running into people is what I'm honestly afraid of. I feel like there's going to be people out in the woods at some of these locations. See? What the heck? Because I know that... In vanilla... Is that a rat? It's set up so there's like some bedded locations. Okay, maybe that's not people. Maybe I'm just seeing rats. Well, rats aren't that scary. I really would almost rather leave them alone because they're a nuisance, but... They're at least not terribly scary. Oh, no, except the glowing rats. Those are a little bit scary. Moderately, actually. What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? See what I mean, man? Terrible. Alright, still doing okay. Still doing okay. There was a third rat. Doe. Oh, wait, is that a fire? No, I don't think that's a fire. Where there's fire, there's people. I'm sort of tempted to kill the deers. That's good experience. Oh, crap. I just walked back to the street. Okay. Oh, thank you, rats. Thank you for the diversion. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, more rats. These ones should just be regular, though. Maybe we'll go try and fight them. I think only the glowing rats are poisonous. I don't think I've been poisoned by normal rats before. That was weird. Crap. Crap. Get away. Here it comes. Oh god. Get away. Yo, why are you, why are these rats giving me so much trouble? This is not normal. Holy crap. We've not even made it that far. We've barely gone anywhere, dude. We're burning all this ammo on freaking rats. How much ammo do I have? Genuine question. All right, we got plenty. Plenty of 3.8. Plenty of shotgun. Okay, now we're down by Concord. Presumably. All 
All right, hopefully things are chill. Things should be chill right here for a little bit. There we go. Oh, I discovered thicket, which we're not really gonna mess with. But I discovered it. Holy textures, dude, you gonna load in? What the heck? Huh, nothing to click for Red and the boys. Well, I found this. Maybe I should report it to the Frost team, or maybe... I think this is just those textures, the granite textures not loading in. Okay, no idea what's going on here. Apparently everything is break. Yo, look at these textures. Oh my god, dude. Well, I definitely know we're near Tem Pines if we're at Thicket, so that's good. I'm wondering if this is it up here. This might be Tem Pines. Is that a deer or a bear? Jeez, I can't. That could go either way. We are definitely, like, right on Tempines. This has to be it. Let me see a little bit of light in the darkness. Oh, no. Alright, folks, we did it. We're finally injured. Take a doctor's bag, we'll use a bandage. We're gonna keep it pushing. Maybe I went a little too north. Where exactly is Ten Pine? This is so hard in the pitch black, people. I'm sorry. What is this? Wine and a corpse. Okay, I'm, I'm getting real desperate just to find ten pines here. Things are starting to get a little sketchy for me. Oh, wait, the railroad tracks. We're on, we're on track. We're on point. Where exactly? It's like right up here. Crap, there's a dog. Is it sleeping? I think the dog is sleeping. No chance I can see it. All right, well, we've got to at least be on track. I, the, the railroad tracks, dude, we're so close. Gotta be, unless I've already passed it. Is that an enemy or ten pines? I feel like. Hey! Hey! So then there's even friendly people. Yeah! 
Look at you. What's up, water pump man? Why am I plus seven radiation? Why am I pulsating plus seven radiation? I don't think this is supposed to be happening. Does anybody know what this is? Never seen this before. Can I sleep on this? Oh crap. What is going on? Feel ill, weakness. Take plus 20% damage? Oh, buff out cures? Yeah. Now we're parched. Alright, let's see what happens though. Cool, we cured our weakness, dude. Talk about overcoming trials and tribulations. So that was a part of weakness? The fact that I kept getting a plus seven pulsating rads? I think? That was really weird. Okay, I don't think we're gonna kill these people and take their settlement. I think we're gonna leave them be. And since I need a shorter episode due to birthday weekend shenanigans, this is probably also where we're gonna wrap this one up. Get a last couple cack roaches here. Oh, of course it hit me. Yeah, we are gonna get sick from cockroaches and rats. That's just gonna happen. Dang, dude, I really got one more level, huh? I'll take it. And cockroach meat to eat. You guys don't know what this means. This is huge. All these little things, they're huge. Okay, let's take a level up, eh? Okay, just to do it, please don't hate me. We're gonna get it out of the way. We're gonna take Scrounger 2. So theoretically, this should be the first real start of the fix to our ammo problem. I don't think I've ever actually taken Scrounger 2, so I can't guarantee. But I've heard good things and I have a good feeling. I have a good feeling. Let's go cook our cockroach meat. Lady, don't you take my thing. Sick. Cockroach meat. Oh, I thought cockroach meat also gave you sanity, but it doesn't. It just takes your weight. Where am I getting the plus 10 from? Oh, the buff out. Okay. All right. We still got this wine we could drink, but at a huge risk of addiction after already drinking a beer. Let's see. Yes, we're good. Because I think it would have already said we have an addiction by now. So, somehow we've subtly worked our sanity up while out here in the wasteland, which is not easy to do. I'm going to consider that actually a huge win. But I think also that is going to be where we wrap up our journey for today, folks. So, this I'm counting as a settlement for a settlement save. We're not taking it. We're going to be nice. But uh, as far as save points go, I think this is fair enough to call a settlement save point. Sleep. Oh, you know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, it'll let me put as many hours as I want, but this is just a stupid dirty mattress, so we can only sleep four hours or five hours, whatever it is. I don't really know, because I never actually sleep on dirty mattresses, but anyway, that's going to wrap it up for this one then. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Dang, what's up, girl? Hello. I can't Hello. remember the last time I had clean fingernails. Oh. Let's track of how many blisters I got. My back hurts, my feet hurts, everything hurts. Another day of hard work. It never changes. You still pretty good looking though, girl. Shoot. Man, you look better with the EMB on. We'll keep the EMB on, but in the dark, you look you pretty good looking. Alright.